that's why I say a lot of times you're already there and when you're not involved with story of your own story or story of the world, like we got to get rid of Donald Trump and we have to get him out of the office or we, or we, gotta, we can't let Biden to win or what is happening in the world is not right and it's going the wrong direction. These involvements with life these ideas we have that how things should be or how your own life should be or how your spirituality should be, all of the ideas and you, dis you have disconnected from the ideas and you have disconnected from your mental stream of thoughts and so you're here simply in a state of being in a state of natural being yeah. and so when this enlightenment happens you're you're going to be in this natural state of being all the time it's not a big bang. Well, I was in the yeah. Right. Or yeah. Stable states. Exactly. It's just it's a it's not personal anymore. It's an it's a impersonal event that happens. Nothing has changed in the world, yet everything has changed for you. So, yeah, in this, in this place that you naturally go into it at times, it's in the absence of your thinking mind because it's in your thinking mind that you're involved with things because it's an idea of what is going on in the world is right or wrong. But when you go into this enlightenment place, Everything is exactly the way it needs to be. Nothing needs to be different. Because nothing is separated from you. It's all perfectly being revealed. So you lose this engagement of the idea of things should be different because God doesn't know what God is doing. Creation doesn't know. And obviously, you know a lot more than the Creator. So things should be your way. You lose that. You lose that part. So now you're in your natural state all the time. And that doesn't mean your natural state all the time. It doesn't mean if someone breaks into your home or an idiot comes and fixes your roof, today you spend $3,000 on the roof and three days after it falls, the roof falls and they didn't do a good job, now you're pissed off and you're angry at them and you're yelling at them on the phone. That also is a part of it. So yeah, you're engaged with something in a moment, but you're no longer dwelling in this place of this world is screwed up and it should be according to your image of an idea of how it should be. You're in this place that's not engaged anymore in that sense. And also, you're in this place that you're not dwelling in your past. And you're not bringing past stuff, projecting it in your future. So you're free from it. Completely free f from all of it. And yeah, you remain an observer of this life. You see things come and go. Things appear and things disappear. But you don't have any judgment or any story about it that it should be different. It's surrendered to what is. 
Hence, you're free. And you experience this. The state of enlightenment, it's you experience that there are moments in your life for everybody, whether you're on spiritual path or not, that you are in this place. You are in this very relaxed space. You're just totally relaxed. Yeah? Have you been relaxed in your life? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Do you do anything for it to be relaxed or you're just relaxed? Um, I would say I relax naturally, but if I was tense about something or other, I would make a particular effort to relax. Yeah. You're relaxed. You're relaxed naturally. Correct? Mm -hmm. Right. So that's exactly what I'm pointing out to. For that, you don't have to do anything. It's just something that happens with something that is, that you are relaxed naturally without an effort. And if something tense happens, then you try to relax. But there are times in your life that you're simply in this place. And there's no story about it. Yeah. I need to be enlightened. I need to da 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 da. I need da da da. I need to change this. If I find my lover and my partner of life, then everything is good. You're just simply chilling out and you're just relaxed and you're not engaged with any stories. And that's the moments that that's the glimpse of awakening. In those moments, you are awakened, fully, fully awakened. That is a permanent awakening state. Mm -hmm. And yeah, that... It's not, you know, it's not getting... Uh, it's being in the present and uh, without expectation, but responding as things are revealed to you. Exactly. You... And you... Being with that, but not planning the, the future... I, I like when you said the, not be thinking of the past or the future. I'm certainly guilty of that, you know. So that's interesting. So you, you need to leave that also to the present moment and to respond to what comes up or what is revealed as your life is revealed. Yeah, there. Yeah, exactly. And let me tell you something. I mean, there is nothing wrong to go into your 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 past events to derive some information from it. 